This is how to upgrade camera firmware in batch through an NVR using Hike Vision's batch configuration tool. You may also use remote configuration in IVMS 4200 and the process is the same once you have entered remote configuration. Now first I'm going to show you how you can see the current camera firmware versions. I have logged into the NVR's web interface. I went to configuration and under system go to camera management. This shows me a list of the cameras connected and their firmware versions on the right. I can see that the cameras I'm going to upgrade are channels 3 through 7. All of those cameras take the same firmware and thus I can upgrade all those cameras in batch. Now to do that I go over to the Hike Vision batch configuration tool. Here is that device I was logged into on the web interface. So in here I want to click on the configuration icon for that device. It opens up the remote configuration menu. Just wait for the menu to load. The speed at which the menu loads will depend on your internet connection between your computer and the device. Okay, now go to System Maintenance. And this is where you could upgrade the NVR's firmware, but below that there is an IP camera upgrade button. I'm going to upgrade IP cameras, so I click this button. And I'm going to select the cameras I want to upgrade. Now actually I could just leave all of the cameras selected and choose my firmware file and upgrade. Any cameras that the firmware file is not compatible with will simply be ignored. However, I'm going to select the specific cameras. The cameras were 3 through 7. Now click the three dots to select the firmware file. It's in my documents. IP camera value plus 5.4.5. I select the digicap.dav file, click open, and click upgrade. Now this upgrade process will take several minutes. It has to upload the file to the NVR, and the NVR will upgrade all the cameras in batch. Just wait for this process to complete and you will get a completed notification. The upgrading process has now finished and I can see that upgrading succeeded on all of the cameras. Now I have gone back to the NVR web page. Following the camera upgrade, the cameras will take a few minutes to reboot and come back online. I'm going to click refresh now in the web browser and I want to check for the firmware upgrade. So right now the cameras are 5.4.4 and if I refresh and once the cameras are back online it will be 5.4.5 and they are. The cameras have already rebooted and reconnected to the NVR except for this one. So I'll just wait a little longer and click refresh again and that one will come back online and we'll see that as 5.4.5. After waiting a little longer and clicking refresh, I see that the camera has now come back online and it is 5.4.5. So now all of the cameras I upgraded have been confirmed. And this concludes the video on how to do a batch camera firmware upgrade through an NVR using the remote configuration interface, which is available in Hike Vision's batch configuration tool and IVMS 4200.